Police sent out to find him or her slave catchers. Under the new Fugitive Slave Act, they could now send federal marshals into the north to extract them. Girl, if I was free and somebody tried to drag me back home, oh, everybody died. The new law also brought bounty hunters into the business of returning slaves to their masters, which we call modern-day police. I mean, it is what it is. A former slave could be brought back into the South to be sold back into slavery if he or she was without freedom papers. In 1851, there was a case of black coffeehouse waiter who was kidnapped by federal marshals on behalf of John Debris, who claimed to be the man's enslaver. So you could just walk up to anybody and say, oh my God, that was my slave with no freaking proof and they're just going to drag you back. Like, that's messed up. Escaped slaves often faced harsh punishments after being captured, such as amputation of limbs, whippings, brandings, and hobblings. How they just put this in one little sentence is beyond me. Individuals who aided fugitive slaves were charged in 